Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life to.com. Today is another edition of Get the Lobby Crave. And today I'm going to be sharing with you three common lies men tell that you should run away from. Uh, listen, last week I did not share a video because I've been working so intensely hard on doing all these interviews with love experts that I'm going to be sharing with you on my Deeper Love Summit. I'll be sharing with you all the details next week, so stay tuned. But right now, I want to share with you some practical advice that you can use and open your ears and eyes and entire hearts to so that when you hear these things, you raise up a really big red flag and you can take better action. These are things that I get to hear all the time, not just from clients that I serve, but from thousands of people that get to share with me their stories via email. <laughs> the first one is, I'm working on my divorce. <laughs> Listen, these are some, some of these lies are things that we want to believe are true, but may not necessarily be true. And I am not saying by this that some guys are not really working on that divorce, but I can tell you that by far, and this is a very unscientific poll based on just my experience, most men that say are working on a divorce are not doing anything, are thinking about it, have potentially opened up their idea to their partner, but that does not make them available. So if you happen to be connected with or engaging in a relationship with someone that is working in this divorce, be very mindful of what that could mean. It could mean years of him trying to figure things out, okay? Uh, second one is, I'm not sure what I want. I'm confused. Listen, guys have definitely uh, the opportunity to be confused sometimes. But if they're starting a relationship with you, or you're already involved in one and they're feeling confused, my advice to you is give them all the space they need on their freaking own without you intervening, without you connecting with them, without you being close to them so they can figure out what they want. Most men who use this phrase, I'm not sure what I want, it's in a way kind of like code for what I want right now is not something meaningful. What I want right now is to have fun. What I want right now is simply to get my needs met and I don't have the heart to tell you that I don't want something deep, that I'm not looking for commitment. So if you can use my words right now, this translation, and see if it fits into your reality, you might decide that the guy that's confused is someone who really deserves to be with no one at this point. The last one is a lie and not a lie. It might be true, but it's not true in the sense that <laughs> you'll see what I mean. If you ever hear the phrase, I don't deserve you. <laughs> if you ever hear you're too much for me, you're too good for me, that's why I'm not right now doing this. That is code word for I don't have the guts, I don't have the cojones to step up and become the man I need to become to be your man. That's really what it boils down to. So if a man is telling you he doesn't deserve you, it's probably true he doesn't deserve you, but not because he doesn't have the qualities, but because he doesn't have the guts to actually do whatever he needs to do to own your heart. I hope this three find some way into your psyche. And uh, as I said before, these are not necessarily, these don't mean necessarily that the guy is lying to you. Sometimes the guy is unaware that what he's saying is complete BS. But for the most part, if you look at these red flags and you use them to your advantage, you can find yourself saving your, your life <laughs> from years and years or months of pain of a relationship that goes nowhere. Thank you so much for allowing me to share this with you. And if you have not subscribed to my list, you can do so by signing up on the link below. Uh, I'll be sharing with you there a video, three videos that explain three bullet proof habits to get the man you want and aggravate for less. And as I said, next week stay tuned because I'll be sharing with you all the details of how you can gain access for free to all the 12 interviews that I'm doing with love experts. Thank you.